early on you guys were throwing a lot of screens, a lot of kind of short, quick passes. Did, did it feel like that got you into a rhythm, or and how did you kind of assess your early kind of first half? Yeah, I mean, that was just kind of our game plan. Um, they brought a lot of pressure there early, um, a lot of different kind of looks. Um, they kind of had a different game plan every week, so that was just kind of one way to feel them out. Um, yeah, a lot of them did work, but we also missed on a couple, and I thought, you know, our rhythm wasn't perfect there in the early first half, but I think that last drive, that kind of two-minute drill where we got a field goal with no timeouts kind of set us up well for the second half. What's your overall impression, uh, overall impression of your day? Obviously, I think you would have liked to have been sharper, but uh, when you take it in total, Yeah, in the beginning you... there, you know, we had a couple of miscues just, you know, with myself and, and just some, some some calls we made and some things going on outside that, you know, we'd like to have back. But when we finish strong and we can put those points up, uh, you know, you can't get too disappointed. You just got to, you know, kind of take what we need to fix and take positives and keep going. Helfritz mentioned that he thought you missed some things, but he also said that there were a lot of plays that weren't on you that didn't come through. From your standpoint, how do you feel you played regardless of what happened around you? Yeah, I thought definitely, like I said before, you know, the rhythm was a little off. We didn't, we didn't really, you know, score touchdowns there in the beginning, and, and that starts with me. And but you know, I think in the second, beginning of the second half, end of that first half, when we started moving the ball and tempo, and um, that's how you know we need to play the whole time. And I think we can kind of look at that and say, hey, this is what it needs to be, and, and kind of work on that. Schneider in the uh, confessional area. Questions for Jeff. Oh, great, man. Uh, heard that somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> Anybody else? Right, right here in front. Vincent. Jeff, like you, like you pointed out, not much rhythm till late. Say, and then, you know, overall, you're looking at your numbers and so forth and then points. I mean, really, that was a pretty productive outing for you. Did, did you, were you sort of more emboldened with confidence as the game went on? And how is your confidence now to be a starter for this team? Perhaps. Yeah, I mean, we got to start better. Um, that starts with me. There's, you know, there's no excuses there, but, you know, it felt good just kind of being out there. First time, you know, getting consistently hit since I was, you know, 17, 18 years old. So, um, you know, that was good to finally, you know, hey, get hit and get back up. And, you know, it's a little different taking hits for, you know, a whole game than, you know, maybe one or one quarter. So I think, you know, kind of settling in there, getting some good shots and moving the ball, I think you know, definitely, you know, progressed as the game went on. You've been kind of waiting for this day for a while. What were the nerves like, and did they kind of match with what you expected? Um, yeah, it's always kind of hard to see how you're going to feel um, when that moment actually comes. But, you know, it was, you know, pretty control. You know, all my teammates uh, came up to me, and, and they are happy to have me in there and confident and coach health. And so just kind of having my teammates' support going out there really helped, you know, me kind of relax and just knowing that, you know, these guys got my back and, and we're going to move the ball. Is there a play from today you're most proud of? Um, yeah, made. there's a couple. I mean, I'd say, you know, just there in that early uh, second half when we had that play on and, and they were bringing some pressure and we made the perfect call to pick up the pressure and then we hit them where they weren't. And I thought that's just, that's exactly what we want as offense. Uh, it was a Charles Nelson out on the sideline. Yeah, they, uh, they were bringing that corner in and we saw it. We pushed the protection all the way out there and then we hit them right there. And that was, you know, that's what we want to be. And we got to do more like that. Anyone else? One more right here. Last one. Make it good. You really made a case for more playing time as the season progresses, no, you know, no matter what Vernon's status is? Yeah, I mean, you know, I'm just going out there and we're just trying to win. Um, I think if you ask Vernon and you ask Coach Elfrich, uh, I don't think anyone, you know, really truly cares who's out there as long as we're winning games. And, um, you know, if I get another opportunity, if something happens to Vernon or, or whatever it may be, it's good to have this kind of building block to, you know, you've been out there before, you've been hit, you know how it goes. So, you know, just moving forward and be ready and, you know, just kind of keep winning. We got to, you know, we got a lot of work to do.